Hi, this is Brian Duran with Ari. Today we're going to talk about setting up an array with the SkyPanel X. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you can see the front of the fixture. That's important because when we're building the array, we need to know who's the top, middle, and bottom position. If you're using a console, you're going to need to know the positions so that your pixel mapping makes sense. If you're using a control panel, it's not as important. Your CCT, your intensity, all of your controls are going to be uh, acting like it's one fixture controlled from one single control panel. So the first thing on our control panel, we'll hit the user button and then scroll over to array setup. And now you'll have a list of your individual fixtures. We're not connected to a console or to a network or anything like that. It's just the ethernet connecting the back of the fixtures. So you'll see uh, in our individual list, if I hover over one of them, it will flash blue to let me know what position it's in. So let me grab my top unit here and I can add that to an array. We'll create a new array and assign it the top fixture position. And now we can move on to the next light in our array. I can see that that's the middle position. So I'll go ahead and add that to the array as well. And I'll add it to the one we created earlier. Call it the second fixture. And now we can grab our third fixture and add that to our array. And now we have the entire X23. So from here, if you want to control it with a control panel, it's as simple as hitting the mode button and scrolling over to your favorite color mode, you know, your CCT, your HSI, your XY. We'll just grab whichever one we like to use. And if I bring up the intensity, you can see that I have full control over the X23 array with just one control panel. Now, if you don't want to use the Wemo cable, you can just plug your control panel into the back of any of the three fixtures and control it that way. Now, if you're using a lighting console, you can control this entire X23 array with just one profile. That's your mode eight, it's 24 pixels of control, and it's only 85 channels, meaning you could fit six X23s on a single universe. If you're using it this way, you would have your intensity as a global setting, you'd have global CCT, global plus minus green, and then 24 RGB channels for your different pixels. And if you're using the X22, the two by two format, you have mode seven for 16 pixels of control, that takes 61 DMX channels, meaning you could fit eight of them on a single universe. Thanks for watching. If you want to learn more about the SkyPanel X, check out the rest of our tech talks or visit us at ari.com slash SkyPanelX.